What's up guys, this is Gidas FIFA and welcome to another episode of Bad Road to Valencia. Now before we start the proper episode I wanted to show you the checklist because as of now, as of recording this episode, there are four new transferred players to Valencia. It's Tabia, Nani, Robert and Salva Ruiz that you can see in the middle column. Um, Three of them are shy, they're not, not very good, they're very cheap, fortunately. Uh, the other one is Nani, a very good card, but as of making this episode, he goes for 17,000 coins on PlayStation. His price is going down, so we hopefully will be buying him in the future. He's a great signing, and um, I, I think he will be our first team uh, first team player here in, uh, in our Road to Glory. So, right now let's start with the um, proper episode. As you can see, I played a fitness game. Sorry, a fitness game just to regain some fitness on the players. Very good way to, to do that. Uh, because, you know, it's 12 minutes of boring gameplay when you score 5 goals. And that's just it. Other than that, that's my transfer list. Unfortunately, only one... Oh, sorry, only one item sold, but uh, I decided to go and do some bronze packs. I used to do them a lot in the early stages of FIFA because they were more profitable, and right now they are starting to get more profitable as well. The fitness cards are going for stuff, good players are going. Uh, so yeah, right here we've got a Bundesliga player and we've got a BPL player, they will hopefully sell. Um, rare contract sell, some training cards, some... Uh, what do they call, are they called? Coaches. They all sell sooner or later, but they do sell. As you can see, we got this guy, Kim, right here, plus 5% speed. Hopefully, he will sell for the 200 as well. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that's basically why I decided to open a few bronze packs, and right now, there are more bronze and silver in forms, so uh, there is a chance of getting them. I got, like, I, I think I packed four bronze team of the seasons, uh, in those bronze packs, so why wouldn't I? Unfortunately, those bronze packs weren't that great. Um, I just listed the fitness card for, I think, 250 coins and the English players. Also, some badges and kits sell, especially the rare ones. Um, some coaches, so it is, for 400 coins, it's very hard to lose your money. And, yeah, I decided to just, just play along, just open a few packs that I wanted to be transparent for you guys, wanted to show you where my coins come from. Most of them are from gameplay, because, you know, we play games, we've got the gameplay bonus, usually we've got, uh, right now, we've got the 1000 coin per game bonus from the store, so that's very, very nice. Other than that, uh, the silver pack method, bronze pack method, that is always a good way to do stuff. And in the future I will hopefully uh, sell all the stuff from my catalog, the badges and everything. You can quick sell them all, get some nice monies, it always helps you. And that's why we are on 24,000 coins. Um, 24,000 coins right now. And once again another, another coach that sells. Um, so yeah, in this episode I wanted to basically buy myself full box, change the team around, because I cannot play with three at the back anymore. Uh, I think I opened one more pack here, we're currently expressing issues with the store, but, un but fortunately the pack opened and we didn't lose any coins on that. And yeah, in here I actually got three American players from the MLS with the uh, with that, with that perfect link, but I decided to keep them because the team of the season MLS and MLS tournaments will be coming soon. Uh, I, I think they may, might even be next week or something, I, I don't know. Um, so they will sell for some money, they will be worth uh, some money then. So yeah, I wanted to buy some players, and the first one is uh, the newly transferred left-back, Salva Ruiz, because he's the worst of them left-backs. He's worth 250 coins, as you can see, so I decided to buy him. 
uh, be before it by like Orban, Sikera, etc, etc. I just wanted to use him in Division 9 uh, after all, so that's not a problem. And then I bought Baragan. I wanted to buy Cancelo before Baragan, but as of making this episode, it was the, the Portugal France tournament, so his price was higher than usual. Uh, so I was contemplating really not buying anyone, but then I really wanted to buy that Baragan. He will be our first team player for now, then we'll buy Cancelo, and that's it. So now they will get their check marks on the checklist. I'm Batman. So as you can see guys, we are going into the team. Uh, I'm basically moving this team around, getting some fitness. I just want to benefit as much as I can uh, from the cards that I have, the untradeable cards that I have uh, with their fitness. So I brought a Baragan to the team as you can see and I brought Salva Ruiz to the team as well. And then I basically swapped around the team so I can uh, enjoy more fitness as you can probably see Jonatas who we played in uh, the offline games had very low fitness, same as Gonzalez, same, uh, same as Hasebe. That's just very small things that make Road to Glories more successful. If you can rotate the players, care about their uh, care about their fitness, etc, etc. Same here, we might be using those bronze players that I put here, those two French bronze players, only offline. But you know, you are using them, so why not have them on full fitness? So the last thing I did before I went into the only game of this episode, uh, I actually wanted to give the right give the right kit numbers to my players. Oh, that's second to last, because I wanted instructions as well. Um, so then Baragan, he will be getting a number 19 as it is his number and Salva Ruiz will get a number 33 as far as I remember. Mm. And yeah, I, I, I thought I, I, I recorded instructions, I didn't. So that's my opponent in the divisions. I wasn't really scared of him. Uh, he had very low low chemistry and as you can see we had a corner very early on. Viaba got to the corner, Viaba shoots, Viaba scores. He's just an amazing player Vialba, I absolutely love playing with him and fortunately this opponent was very very easy. Once again we've got Jovetic right here, Jovetic sees a pass to Griezmann, Griezmann shoots, Griezmann scores, 2-0 and basically I knew that the game was behind me at this point. Uh, in here we cleared the ball with the goalkeeper, Go the ball falls to Vialba who keeps the ball, assists Griezmann, who shoots, who scores, 3-0, easy breezy. And then in the 70th minute, uh, he gave me the ball with his goalkeeper. I shoot with Rakitic and it was for nil. And at this point, my opponent gave up. I think I show you. He's just passing around his defense. Uh, he didn't even try to move the ball forward. So I was basically happy with that. I let him have the 4 nil loss. He didn't want to quit. So yeah. Basically, that's how the game ended, as you can see. 4 nil, the first win in Div uh, 9, and I am very happy with that. So that's going to be the end of the episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, if you did, smash the like button. If you And if you are new around here, make sure to click on the subscribe button. Both of them are below. Below, you can also find the link to my Twitter page. If you want to message me, you can do it via comments, via Twitter. I make sure to respond to every single message. Uh, in the next episode, I will try to make a more of a full cam team by replacing uh, Jovetic and replacing Gabbiadini, maybe, and maybe mm, changing the formation as well. We've got two more games with Busquets and uh, and Rakitic, so basically that that's all I can do. Um, so I have to be prepared to bring someone on for them. But for the next episode, uh, I, I will be making sure to replace Jovetic and Gabbiadini. They will stay in the team, of course, as super subs, because uh, they were very, very, very good for it. And for now, the only player that we will be... The only players that we will be missing from the full Valencia team are Griezmann, 
um, Griezmann, Busquets and Rakitic uh, and, and yeah, I'm very happy we're getting closer and closer to the full team I'm very happy with how the team plays so that's going to be it I will be seeing you soon Bye!